Hello, welcome. I'm another Magento dev. I just wanted to do a quick video because I'm doing some work on a on a client site that was a bit of a reskin and a, an upgrade to Magento 2.4.1, and I noticed that they've not ever had any of the um, minification settings set in the in the back end when I was in developer mode on my on my local host. This is the um, this is the the sort of my dev site so this is the the local site um, and when you're in developer mode um, there is some settings um, in the admin under a specific menu item that um, that you can control the minification and the bundling um, of the CSS and the JavaScript it's just under advance and in developer as you can see um, JavaScript settings, merge JavaScript files, um, enable JavaScript bundling, um, minify JavaScript. They're all set to. They're all set to. No, I just, I just was looking. But essentially, I was looking at some lighthouse reports, um, and I did a couple of spot checks on um, on lighthouse report on a couple of products. Now, nothing too fancy on a on a product page. All your all your usual stuff, um, and on the live site currently, it's coming out at sixty one. Performance for for a lighthouse before uh, report. So I thought, well, you know, we can surely do something about that. Um, so I thought, well, first thing I would do is uh, let's turn on these settings. The default image and oh, should you know everything should should be okay. Um, and I did. And this is the dev site on the same server, and it's a ninety four. Like, that's incredible, really. To be fair, um, and. I think a lot of the time these these settings get missed uh, when you're in production mode because when you're in production mode, look at that you don't have you don't have developer, you don't have the uh, you don't have the option to to toggle these things on and off. They're just not right in front of you uh, in the admin. So um, you can obviously log on via SSH and here. Um, there's a handful of commands and and these do the trick I mean uh, I, for the purposes of this quick video I'm going to stay away from JS bundling because it can be problematic um, but merging and minifying we just need to do it um, that's all I've done I've just set these things so dev JS merge files dev JS minify files dev CSS merge CSS files and dev CSS minify CSS files all to uh, all to on basically um, and then I mean you've got there's a couple of things actually you can see here I've hit a couple of um, I've hit a, 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 an error a couple of oh, I've hit an error a couple of times when trying to sort of redeploy the change because this does for these changes to take effect that it does take a, a full deploy um, you know the what you want to be doing is obviously running static content um, that's what you want to be doing running static content but you get a bit of an I, I got a bit of an area and it's one to watch out for but there was a, quite a simple simple fix all I did is just removed um, static I just force removed static content and um, and pre-processed um, and ran ran uh, static content deploy again and um, yeah it went, it went straight through and literally immediately the next page speed next lighthouse uh, test I did jumped up to 94 so I would uh, I would do this definitely